Good morning, you're in the kitchen with Jenny. I am going to do a banana island today, just for today, because I have tons of ripe bananas, and if you don't know what that is, it's basically where you just eat bananas all day long. So I'm gonna give you a few of the benefits of bananas. I have here my iPad, and I'll put a link down below to this article so you can read more about the benefits of bananas. All right, so. Just a few reasons. Um, bananas help overcome depression due to high levels of tryptophan, which convert into serotonin, which is the happy mood brain neurotransmitter. Um, they're rich in pectin, they aid in digestion, and they help, they help gently remove toxins and heavy metals from the body. Um, they're a natural prebiotic, so they stimulate um, the growth of friendly bacteria in your bowel. And they're high in fiber, and um, they can actually stop you from having diarrhea if you have diarrhea. So those are just a few reasons. And for anybody who's worried about potassium overdose, it's impossible. Your body releases all the potassium that it doesn't need through your urine. So you can eat as many bananas as you want, and you'll be just fine. It's also good for after you work out, you know, it gives you enough energy to have like, I think it was two bananas or something is enough energy for like an hour workout or something. Check out the article. Like I said, I'm posting it down below. It's from Food Matters um, TV, so you know it's a good article. Um, so here we go. I'll show you. I'm gonna make a banana smoothie. That's all the bananas that are left from the pile there that I had. So my blender is full. And now I'm gonna add like half a teaspoon of cinnamon. And I'm gonna put some coconut sugar in there too. So coconut sugar is also full of riboflavin, B vitamins, and minerals. It's good for you. I'll have to do another video about coconut sugar too and how good it is for you. I'm gonna put two more tablespoons of coconut sugar in there. And I'm using rice milk because it makes it taste like a banana horchata and it's so yummy. One whole 32 fluid ounce container. Here we go. <laughs> blend it for more more than 10 seconds because um, then the bananas will get bitter so that's that here it goes in the clean canteen Sorry that my hand's been a little shaky lately. Trying to get used to filming myself. I ordered a tripod type thing, so hopefully pretty soon you have absolutely steady videos. Anyway, so that's what I'm having for breakfast. And I'm actually gonna have to blend up a few more for my lunch. And that'll go in again in my blender bottle. And that's it, and then when I come home, I'm gonna have the same thing for dinner, except, um, Maybe I'll stick something like, I don't know. I don't know, but it'll probably be the same because that'll keep it the simplest and easiest to do. Sharing a personal moment. My favorite movie is The Labyrinth, so I just want to share with you guys my cool hair bow. It's the Vam from The Labyrinth. Oh my goodness. Hello. Alright, so please like and subscribe and tell your friends. Come visit me again. And I'll let you know tomorrow how I felt after Banana Island. Because, like I was saying before, I was having like digestive issues because I ate that macaroni and I had all the high fat from the vegan cookies and stuff. So I'm doing this because I want my stomach to feel better. 
So I'll let you know tomorrow how I feel and if I have a lot of energy because bananas are supposed to give you energy, right? Especially if you eat a lot, a lot of fruit calories. It's good for you, all right? Have a good day, everyone.